guys and welcome back to another video. This will be tonight's episode of um, Baseball Recaps and Rants. So let's get into it. Um, our main subject for today is going to be the Toronto Blue Jays um, blowing a 4 run lead. So they kind of choked to the Orioles. You know, those two teams are usually at the bottom of the division. They're doing pretty well this year. But yeah, they choke a lead, but then they're able to win it in the top of 10th on the air, you know, with that ridiculous... Um, that insane extra inning rule with the runner at second. I might rant about that at some point. But uh, our secondary things for today is going to be um, the Mariners and Dodgers had a very low-scoring game. So what happened there was the Dodgers won 2-1. to one. Um, Austin Barnes kind of carried them. He scored two runs. Corey Seager had a two-out go-ahead single in the bottom of the eighth. And it gave the Dodgers the win. Um, Victor Robles with a key robbed home run as the Nationals beat the Braves over in Atlanta. And also, in the top of the first, Will Myers kind of copies Fernando Tatis Jr. against the Grand Slam. This one's not 3-0, though, and no one got angry about this one. Which brings me to today's rant. And the rant today is going to be Fernando Tatis Jr. and the unwritten rule change. Now, I just think this is ridiculous. How? How do you get so angry over someone hitting a Grand Slam on a 3-0 pitch. It's a second-year player. It's a young guy from another country, and you're going to get mad because he wants to swing 3-0 and hit a Grand Slam. You're mad because you're losing by a bunch, and he does that. Why are you losing by a bunch, Rangers? It's not his fault that you guys suck so much. So what? I don't understand why. What? How is it even possible to get mad over that? I mean, I just don't understand. How? It, it, it doesn't make – it doesn't – it doesn't make any sense to me. I think it's just absolutely insane that you can get angry over someone stepping up there, going to swinging 3-0, you know, and hitting a grand slam. Like, make a better pitch 3-0 maybe so he won't hit a grand slam. All right? Like, this is a guy that, you know, it's a second-year player. You know, he wants to he wants to play well. He's leading the league in home runs, you know. He's a young, a young player that he just wants to have fun and he wants to – Played his best, and the fact that you're gonna get mad and make him apologize for hitting a grand slam is insane to me. I, I mean, like I just think I, I'm just thinking of how livid I would be if I hit a grand slam and people got mad at me for that. Like I would be like, "What are you so mad about? Get me out next time." Like it's not his fault that the pitcher made three bad pitches in a row and that the Rangers suck and are losing by a bunch like always. I think it's just insane. It makes absolutely zero sense. It's just, if you're a logical person that knows the game of baseball, you don't get mad about that. Now, I get it, you know, some of the boomers want to respect the unwritten rules. But even, even, even if you're on that side for the unwritten rules, this shouldn't exist. This is absolutely absurd that, that anyone even has it in their thoughts to get mad about this. Like, it just doesn't make any sense to me. Why? Why Why would you pick this to get mad about? It's just, it's, if you're going to, if you want to get mad, then do it. Get mad over something logical, you know? Get mad about a brawl. Get mad about the Astros not getting punished, something like that. But you're going to get mad over this? It's just, this, it's wild, guys. I don't know. It, it's messed up. But uh, that's going to do it for this video. Um, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. By the way, um, the reason you guys can't comment is because, um, because I'm a child, and if chi if children show their face on the videos, then you're not allowed to comment. So I'm sorry about that. It's not my choice, but I'll see you guys in the next one.